This method can help answer key questions in the ion channel related retinal diseases field about the molecular mechanisms of BEST1 mutations and the pathology of BEST trophenopathies. The main advantage of this technique is that it circumvents the difficulty of directly obtaining RPE cells from humans. The implications of this technique extend toward the therapy of BEST trophenopathies, including BEST disease, as the RPE cells can be used for both research purposes and cell replacement therapies. When the HPSC culture reaches confluency, replace the culture medium with 4 milliliters of differentiation medium per well of a 6-well plate. After two weeks of culture, supplement the differentiation medium with 100 nanograms per milliliter of human activin A changing the supplemented media three times a week for another 14 days. On day 29, switch to non-supplemented differentiation medium for another 8 to 10 weeks until pigmented RPE cell clusters appear. To isolate the pigmented RPE cells, first, hold individual 9-inch glass pasture pipettes horizontally over the flame of a Bunsen burner, about two-thirds down the length of the thin part of the pipette. When the heated glass turns soft, quickly pull the two ends apart to form a micro-scraper-like tip at the new end of the pipette. Spray the pulled pipettes with 70% ethanol and let them air dry in a cell culture hood. When the pipettes are ready, wash each well of the differentiation culture with PBS and add 1 milliliter of 0.05% trypsin.